Let's get right to it. Yesterday, someone asked me, why are there so many open roles and why aren't they being filled? That's actually two questions, but let's go ahead and answer them. Let's tackle the first one. Why are there so many open roles in machine learning? The biggest reason is a lack of understanding of what the role looks like in the real world. If you were to ask 10 people that are newbies interested in machine learning, most of them wouldn't be able to tell you what the job looked like. Most would tell you something about math or modeling. It's not either of those. Most of my job, like 80% or more, and often more, is working with data. People don't want to hear that because they've either been studying the wrong material or they believe I'm wrong. How many people know that SQL is one of the top skills for a machine learning engineer in the real world? Not many, I promise. If you don't understand the role, then there's no way you can properly prepare for it. That means all those focusing on modeling right now that aren't in a data or a programming role will never make it to an interview, let alone a job. The next reason why most are going to fail is intellectual stamina. Becoming a machine learning engineer or data engineer is going to take years, not months. That means the ability to stick with learning associated with this role is something most can't do. Many truly believe that a six-month course or preparing a year will be enough. This is a sure sign you're not going to make it. Right now, you're looking at years before you're in a real-world machine learning role at any real company. And that's only if you're learning and studying the correct path. If not, it's not going to happen at all. Let's tackle the second part of the question. Why are so many roles unfilled? In the real world, we call this technical debt. That simply means we can't find anyone with the most basic level of technical aptitude to do the job. Machine learning is about data. Companies are very protective of their data. They would rather do without than risk a mistake caused by an amateur. This goes back to an earlier comment in the video. Machine learning is about data. If you don't have those skills, companies don't want you. It's really that simple. It's why I spend so much effort on helping people understand the role. If you don't understand the importance of data, you'll never make it to any AI role. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and have a great day. We'll see you soon.